Hello everyone, welcome back to the Raw Draws Reviews channel, and today we're taking a look at the Star Wars Black Series, New Republic Security Droid from the Mandalorian line. Look at the front of the box, you get the figure that is included along with the accessory, you also get the name of the line the character's from, and their name down here. And on the side of the box you get this amazing artwork of the Republic Droid, and like I mentioned before, By adding more figures on the same line, you can create a mural. So here's the Republic security droid, alongside Magistrate Grieve Karga. And on the back of the box, you get a bigger portrait of the character, a description, the number which it falls into the line, and a bunch of little warnings. Here's the side of the box, the bottom, and the top. So I'm going to take them out of the plastic, and we see what's inside. Here he is, I'm going to plastic. And here's out of the box. And look at how close, he looks really cool. I love the uh, overall look of the droid. And of course, I'll go ahead and review from top to bottom. Look at the head, it looks very cool. Uh, he has this yellow at the visor. He also has this like antenna uh, piece up here. And he has like this like knob in the back. And he does have a joint at the neck as well as the top of the head. So here side to side, all the way back and all the way forward. Look at the torso. Uh, he has this like gray sort of like color uh, in the front. And has like this black with some detail here in the front. Has these buttons, the New Republic logo right here. And here in the back, he has like this data pad uh, with the New Republic logo as well. I also like how the uh, sort of like shoulder pads are connected to the main body and they're made of a looser plastic so that's really nice to know. And he does have a ball joint here at the waist so your side side all the way back and all the way forward. Look at the arms. The arm sticks out about there. It goes all the way around. His elbow goes up about there. He has a swivel at the elbow. And he has articulation at the wrist and the hand. So here's all the way down, all the way up, and there's a swivel. The other side as well. Arm sticks out about there. Goes all the way around. His elbow goes up about there. As he swivel at the elbow. And he has articulation at the wrist and the hand. Here's all the way down, all the way up, and there's a swivel. Look at the waist. He has this like belt that goes all the way around. He has this back piece, but it does not come off. But I really like this, like, uh, sort of like, uh, what would you call that? Sort of like his uh, midsection. Uh, I really like this sort of like inner look within the droid with this sort of like wiring uh, that goes within it. And then he has like this spinal cord and looks really cool. And look at the legs. The legs do go out a little bit into a split position. They do go out into a same position. And they go back about there. And he does have a swivel on both of his thighs. And look at the knee joints. They go back into a kneeling position. And look at the feet. Uh, they do point down about there. They point all the way up right there. And he does have rock wrinkles. So those are cool action poses. And look at the accessory. He comes with a pistol. Look at the pistol. It looks very nice. It's like uh, one of those... Rebellion uh, sort of blasters that they use. Uh, has a scope, this silver at the barrel, and has a really nice detail uh, going throughout it. To put on the blaster, all you do is just slide in the grip, turn the trigger finger just like that, and you can move his hand right here in front of the barrel to give some support, and it looks really cool. So, as an overview of the figure, this is one of the coolest droids I reviewed in this lineup. At first, I had my disbeliefs about this figure. Um, I didn't really, you know, I sort of like oversaw him uh, when the wave came out. And it wasn't one that I was like immediately drawn to. But after reviewing it, it's really cool. The articulation is great. Uh, the accessory is great. And everything about the figure is spot on. So yeah, if you're wanting to build a security droid army, uh, definitely go with this guy. It's like to do at the end of these reviews. 
Make sure you guys have a display of figures. How are the boxes in the back? And the figure in the front. But I am going to leave it here. And say if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. And if you like the content you see here on the channel so far, be sure to subscribe. And be sure to follow me on my Instagram page. Hope you guys have an awesome Saturday. I'll catch you guys on the next one.